Welcome to this video, which is part of the course on how to create a platform like Shopify, using WordPress and WooCommerce behind the scenes. With this platform, you can sell memberships for users to build online stores quickly. You'll create a nice looking homepage, a custom login page, and a fully customized dashboard, with no programming needed. If you want to take this course, follow the link in the description of this video. We've already configured the global settings for our front-end dashboard with WP Frontend Admin. Here, we'll show you how to configure the theme for the new dashboard, and define its architecture. To define the architecture of the front-end dashboard, you just need to think about the features you want to display on it, and how you want to distribute the features in the pages. Just make sure you think of a logical ordering of the admin pages. For example, this is the architecture or pages order we'll use on our dashboard. We'll set the categories, attributes, and tags to be sub-items of the products item. Also, we'll set all the pages that have to do with the site and store configuration to be sub-items of the settings item. That's what you need to define in this step. You'll need to create a navigation menu for your dashboard. Go to Appearance, Menus, and create a new menu, because you'll use it later to add the admin pages to it. Once you create the navigation menu, you need to set up the theme options for the dashboard to look clean and elegant. For this, we'll use the Ocean WP theme. Normally, you'd have to create the dashboard design from scratch, and that would take lots of hours. Fortunately, WP Frontend Admin has a gallery of beautiful designs that you can import to create your dashboard quickly. With a standard plan, you have access to two Ocean WP templates. With a platform plan, you have access to more than 10 templates, including Elementor templates, which are fully customizable. You can see all of them, following the templates page in the description of the video. There, just click download. Now enter your registered email. We'll email you the file, so you need to check your email and download it. In this example, we use the basic Ocean WP template. To import this template into your dashboard site, you need to open the Ocean Extra import and export options. Choose the file from your computer, click import, and the appearance will be set immediately. Once the theme settings are imported, you can set your own logo and typography if you want. For that, go to the customizer. You can change the logo here. And here you can change the typography. At the end, this is how the dashboard will look, after importing the theme settings and creating all the pages. The next video will be about how to display the WooCommerce reports on the front end.